Welcome back guys to Winget Review. Today we're going to unbox the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 4. This is brand new. I just got my hands on it because this phone is expensive. And not really just get my hands on it. I've been using this phone for a week. But yeah. Let's talk about specs real quick. This phone display has a dynamic AMOLED screen. 120Hz display. Which is crazy. 1200 nits peak brightness. Okay guys. Have NFC, Bluetooth, fast charge 25 watts, and wireless charging and reverse wireless charging also. Okay guys, that's a thumbs up for me. F fingerprint sensor on the right side of the device. And it also has face unlock, which we're gonna talk, talk about later. Dual speaker, top and bottom, which is crazy. Can record in 4K 60 frames per second and also 1080p and auto stuff. This device, uh, this particular device I have is also unlocked. So I work with AT&T, T-Mobile, Verizon, and I think Sprint also because it's also CDMA. Okay, Gorilla Glass Victor Plus. I'm not sure what is that, but that's what I'm reading right now. Okay, guys, the colors this phone comes in. Is gray, gray, green, phantom black, and burgundy. I think is rose gold to me. In my, in my eyes, it looks like rose gold. Okay, the battery life on this thing is amazing. This has a four thousand five hundred milliamp battery, which is crazy for this device. Okay, guys. So let's just do a quick unboxing. Quick package come like this. Take the phone out and that's pretty much it I guess oh wait it has another piece right here let's go with a charging cable which is dope really like that thank you Samsung and manuals in the box so yeah, that's coming with a manual and a SIM rejection pin and a SIM injection pin. So that's that's pretty cool. Thumbs up to Samsung. Only thing it doesn't come with is a charging brick. Samsung. Okay. Samsung. I know you guys are up there now with the popular phones. Or you guys are number one phones right now in the world. Close to Apple. But please put a charging brick in the box. Okay. I spent eighteen hundred dollars for this and charging brick is crazy expensive. Like thirty bucks. Okay, put a charging brick in the box, please. Thumbs up. Okay, let's pull the peel in real quick. Okay, this is crazy. Okay, let's put that to the side. Oh, let's boot up real quick. There is a glory. Samsung. Z Fold 4. My eyes rose gold. Looking nice. Look at that Samsung. I don't know if you guys can see it. With my finger here, I guess. I'm not sure. Yeah, it's right there. Yeah, it looks, it looks pretty nice. Not gonna lie. Looks really, really nice. The camera, though. Jesus. Yep. Come on, Samsung. Let's go. Boot up real quick. And there you go. It's my wallpaper. Put my password real quick. There you go. So Samsung. It's pretty nice. Pretty nice. I really love. I really like it. I never. I never thought I would like this phone, but this phone is actually pretty. Pretty decent. It's a pretty nice phone. I really like it a lot. Especially the screen. Ooh, that screen is amazing. Okay. First thing first. Let's talk about music, how low this device is. This device is crazy loud. And thank you, notification. This device is crazy loud. Face ID unlock fingerprint is right here on the side, on the right hand side of the phone. It's pretty fast. The face ID is also fast when it catches your face, but sometimes when I'm in the car laying down or I'm not looking at the phone properly, it doesn't catch my face that well. But anyway. The camera on this thing is also amazing. Anyway, let's do this real quick. Go to music. 
I found a music on YouTube library and I like it, so I decided to play it. So we're gonna see how low this device is. That's like 50% right there. Let's go higher. Samsung. Look at the animation. That's the sound of the phone and I'm telling you this phone sounds really really good like okay I never thought it would be this loud but it's actually pretty loud it's up there with the iPhone all right that's that's pretty crazy that's crazy yeah that's really crazy I'm not even gonna lie about that I have this wallpaper on it I hope you guys like it it's for me personally I think this wallpaper is pretty dope like I said this can go crazy high brightness well this is like max right now so let's turn it down real quick for the camera Alright, so yeah, that's it. Let's play a little games on this. Like I said, the battery life on this thing is amazing. Not gonna lie. Let's do a quick game so you guys can see the gameplay of the, the device. I like to play it like this for the widescreen. You know what I mean? But yeah, this phone is beautiful, man. This phone is really beautiful. Okay. Turn that down real quick. Let's do a quick fight real quick. Continue. Let's go. Okay, it look like I died already. Woo! This here has a little pixelated. I think it's the, the game. Every time I open this game, it, it has a little like pixelated thing at the bottom. I'm not sure what's going on there. Yeah, let's do it. There you go. If you see it. This game, I think it needs to get an update or something, but yeah, that's pretty much what am I seeing? What I'm seeing, yeah. Alright, let's do a quick fight real quick. Come on, Spider-Man, you got this. Ooh. Oh my god, this girl kicking my butt. Copyright, you know what I mean? Oh, there you go, okay, the old. Yeah, pretty nice. The screen handle, this phone is handling the game pretty well. Oh yeah, I forgot to say, Snapdragon 8 Gen, first gen chipset in this device. So you should be able to handle any game you throw at it. Okay, that's this game so far. Let's try another game. Another game I like to put on all my devices is Genjin Impact because this, this game is so huge. It takes a long while just to download this game and I really want to test the phone limits. Always playing at 60 Hz or 60 FPS I should say. These devices. Oh, I didn't mention the phone come with a charging cable. Yeah, that's another thing I should... I, I don't know if I mentioned it. I don't remember, but I think I did. Anyway, so I was talking to Miss Lynn right here. You know what I mean? I was cooking some stuff. But like I said, the resolution is pretty high. So the resolution right there, so I can, I can show you. Well, these resolution is low, but... Render resolution is high, and I'm playing at 60 frames per second, so that's pretty dope. How do I get back out of here? Oh, here. 
So yeah. We're away from a tree, girl. Let's go. Put this flowers real quick. Drop my teddy bear real quick. Yeah, well, yeah, like I said, look at that. That's that's crazy. This phone is handling this game. It's not even getting hot, which is another crazy thing about this phone. It's really, it's really crazy. It's really crazy. It's really crazy. Let's go up here real quick. Sorry. Let's do the gliding thing. Yeah, so like, like I was saying um my previous videos, my kids like to play Genshin Impact, so I like to add this to the video so you guys can see. It does play games, can play games pretty well. Okay, let's get out of Genshin Impact. Another game my kids like to play is also Minecraft. <sighs> yeah, this this game. I'm not good at this game. So I'm just gonna do a quick gameplay of it to see so you guys can see it can also handle minecraft which is pretty nice loading resources let's go all right it's night anyway playing that man minecraft pretty well what are those things okay that almost killed me oh my god Yeah, playing games. Oh, what? Okay, yeah, yeah. That's this game's not for me. <laughs> I'm, I'm done. <laughs> yeah. So it does play Minecraft pretty well. Another thing I, I, I would say, alright, guys, if you want to spend, like I said, this one is pretty nice. This one is really, really nice for me personally. It's the only kind. The problem I have with this phone is the price. The price is so high, man. Seventeen hundred dollars plus tax on Amazon, which is crazy. I'm gonna put a link in the description so you guys can use a link to find the phone if you want to get it. But yeah, this phone is crazy expensive. I don't see myself buying this phone for myself. I'd rather go with a Z Fold One Three, and I'll stick with that. It's a little bit cheaper on Amazon for also eight hundred dollars. I don't want to spend so much money for a, for a phone. You know what I mean? So I might get this the Z Fold Three. In the future and do a review about that phone also to see how it stacks up against the Z Fold 4. I'm pretty curious how it will stack up with this phone. Anyway, so I was watching this like I was saying earlier today in the video. I was watching I get up 6 a.m. every morning for work and the battery life on this device is pretty solid. 6 a.m. all the way to 10 a.m. I was using the phone non-stop, watching anime, playing music, and just my casual browsing on the internet and Instagram. And this phone delivers. This phone delivers. Just want to show you the screen real quick. How does the screen look when you're watching like some movies or some or something like that? Hopefully it plays. Okay. All right. So this is how it is when I on Crunchyroll or you're just watching videos. It's pretty nice. The screen is pretty nice. That's how it looks. The, the screen is the screen is pretty nice. I don't know what anime is this one, but anyway. Yeah, it's pretty. It's pretty decent. It's a nice. It's a nice. It's a nice phone. I'm not gonna lie. I would. Re I would recommend it for anybody that has the money. But if you don't have the money, I would say go with the Z Fold Three. And save yourself some cash. The cameras on this is also pretty decent. The camera. This is. A what? A triple camera setup. This camera is pretty amazing for taking photos. I have some photos in this phone. Let's see if I can find some photos real quick. Oh, photos. Alright, so this is the photo I take with this phone today. And the photos are pretty, pretty, pretty nice. It's very, very nice. Look at all that pic, what do you call it, pixel? 
that resolution yeah that's that's amazing man i take so many photos with this phone today it's just it's just amazing it's a it's a pretty amazing phone i'm not gonna lie i'm an iphone fan but using this phone today i just want to use this phone all day i don't want to even use i don't want to touch my iphone but yeah this is like the zoom really really zoomed in this was in the tree and I, I can zoom in and take this quality photo of this gecko lizard i think and it's it's pretty nice the the, the quality camera the camera the quality the camera quality is very very nice it's very very nice look at that blurry background that's that way called that boca bokeh and that's my dog choco you know what i mean this phone is amazing this phone camera is pretty it's pretty dope not gonna lie camera camera is pretty dope well, i also wanted to show you guys i think that's pretty much it yeah but yeah like like i said if you want to get this phone and you have the cash i would say go and get it if you have like 1700 laying around go and get it but me personally i don't want to spend that much money for a phone if you have the z fold 3 don't even bother upgrade but i would recommend upgrade if you have a z fold 3 it, with samsung web browser because if you upgrade a z fold 3 you get so much money off to afford to buy this phone which is amazing i think it paid like 300 dollars something around there but this phone is amazing i love the samsung name right here also it just it just fits nice 25 watt fast charge only grab i have with this phone is i wish samsung well only, only grab i have with this packaging but the phone exactly is it doesn't have a charging brick in the box which is crazy seventeen hundred dollars i think they should add it in the box for customers because it's hard to just go out and buy a charging brick pain in the butt unless you want to get the anchor charging brick for an amazon they're like what 25 dollars 29 dollars i'll also put a link in the description that charger brick i would recommend but yeah this this phone is pretty solid and if i if i should rate it i'll rate it a solid 9.5 you know what i mean that's it thumbs up stay chill guys don't forget to like and subscribe thank you for watching ring it review and put your comments down below don't be a hater don't be mean just be honest you know what i mean i'm a new youtuber i'm not a professional at any means uh, this is just me and my personal opinion about these devices so don't leave no hate comments because i got a lot of hate comments on samsung phones already you guys are killing me but anyway Stay chill guys, thank you for watching the wing review and peace, I'm out.